So, yeah, we're here with Volt Catfish. Again. This is... Lips! Wait. <laughs> yes. Lips. <laughs> but... I still can't get over how ridiculous this boss is. I remember when I was a kid, I thought he looked like someone's grandma. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, catfish, you just got burned bad. Oh. Wow, that looked like a drill punch. It's like drill punch. Drill punch. Wow, it's just like, he can't catch a break. Like, oh, I can defeat X. No, he's using the max armor. No, it's golden. It's the hyper max armor. He gets drill punch. And yes, that's what it's actually called. <laughs> it doesn't say in the, it doesn't say that in the game, but the figure of X with the armor says that. Shut up. So is the drill actually his weakness, so you're just using it because it's awesome? Well, considering it takes a ton of health off him and it interrupts his attacks, I'd say it's his weakness. Although, for some reason, the drills get, get bent. <laughs> yeah, so we'll never see him again. <laughs> Funky music. Speed oh. up! Rhinos! What? Said more drills. <laughs> Zombie drills? Well, I don't remember doing that before. He wanted to prove he wasn't as pathetic as we thought. Don't want to know what I have. More drills. <laughs> Shoulder drill. Ow. I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense, corroding metal, but with acid, but I don't know. Everybody knows- in my opinion, hmm? in my opinion, it's one of the more sensible weaknesses in this game. Yet, yet in Pokemon, poison-type uh, poison attacks do not affect steel-type Pokemon at all. Well, it's because they're poison, they're not acid. Oh, of course. Punch! Just for fun. Punch. Oh, it's I'm awesome, but not that tough beetle. That's a long name. We'll call him Gravity Beetle for sure. <laughs> Hyper Max Gatling. I love that all he can do is hop towards you. He can't even dash. That's kind of a bar of... Uh, H money waffles. <laughs> <laughs> Graffiti waffles. I don't know if you have them in uh, Scotland, and I hope you don't, but International House of Pancakes. They are basically gravity pancakes and waffles, because no matter how fat you are, there's always someone 800 pounds heavier than you there. <laughs> Seriously. Well, I've never seen one, but this is called. I said, what is it called? Inter said, International waffles. House of Pancakes, or IHOP for yeah. short. International House of Pancakes. I assume it's international, so I assume we have one over here somewhere. World Series! We win the World Series. Every year. Thanks, Eddie Izzard. <laughs> Alright, that's Crabface. Yes. <laughs> that's his name now. Badass! I am Badass Crabface. I thought you were Crushed Crawfish. No. That was my brother. You killed him. Prepare to die. <laughs> that would be kind of funny. That would be kind of funny if all the other ones were just like, you know, rehashes of the previous bosses, and this one was different. Like, it was someone's brother. They could totally do that sometime. It'd be hilarious. My brother could not fight you. He was too busy being dead. And in a submarine. I think I'm never on this dude, though. I'm probably bringing this up a little bit late, but why exactly are you fighting, like, copies of all the bosses so far in this game? Or in all Mega Man games, to be honest? Well, I think I it's... Think if they could do that, they'd just make every enemy in the game a boss. Well, I don't know. I think mostly it's just supposed to be, like, 
a gameplay element, not really a story thing. It's like, hey, you got all the weapons, why not use your shiny new toys on all the bosses you couldn't before? Well, yeah, there's that. I gotta remember that this game was made years ago and it doesn't have to make sense. <laughs> I mean, it's supposed to kinda, and then the later X Games, they kinda try to be like, hey, it makes sense, really. You know. Also, <laughs> Dr. Topla. With his giant shoulder pads. I know. <laughs> I don't get hung- I don't get hungry, I recycle by plugging my shoulders full of energy. You allow me to stroke my beard to you. Hmm, yes. Did you know I played football? Shoulder pads. <laughs> it took me a little while to connect those dots in my brain since football over here actually involves hitting the ball with your foot. Yeah, football. Go figure. Perhaps you was not as smart as I thought, even though you defeated my entire army. <laughs> you can be smart, but win. <laughs> I guess. Oh no, his his shirt. Oh crap. Oh damn it. Um, yeah, I was gonna own him with the saber, but he put out a healing field right in, right in time. It sounds like some kind of bad plot device. Like, oh, I thought I killed him. No, he put out a healing field at the last minute. He's got magic bullet spray. All those bullets cannot harm Doctor Doppler because he's wearing magic bullet spray. I wish I could say I invented that, but I didn't. Sorry. <laughs> oh, damn invincibility frames. Damn it, Zero. <laughs> Why is the game easier without Zero? What's up with that? <laughs> I'll use your sword better than you. Zero has tried almost as many pieces as he was in Mega Man X2. Well, I think he had a, a contract with the 32-bit generation because he becomes much more relevant in those uh, in X4 and X5. In X6, I guess. Mega Man is getting old. Who else is there? Zero. You'll do. Wait, that's not Epic Explosion. You're cheating death. You just steamed for a bit. I will slash I you. Buff old man take more to kill than that. <laughs> I will slash you with my annoying flickering sound if you move. Oh, he says you were strong enough to defeat Sigma when you've already defeated him like two times already. I didn't believe it because he's my master. I'm a doctor. I don't believe rumors. I need to experiment. Get me the hamsters and rats. <laughs> I say a lot of stuff to you. Yeah. That stuff isn't actually reading. Let's see. The, the viewers can read it if they so choose. I have no idea what's going on here anymore. Well, basically... I thought this was going to be a, this was gonna be a short exchange. It's yeah. been going on for like an hour. Well... The short, uh, the short version, the short version of it is basically Doctor Doppler said, "Oh, I was affected by Sigma. He made me build this new ultimate battle body for him because his original form. I think he actually says it here, but if not, whatever. But he says Sigma's original, Sigma's actual form is that of a virus, so that's why he's able to keep coming back. Like he just op occupies new bodies and he just is a virus, so he's data." Kind of reminds me of a movie I watched once. So it kind of explains, oh, that's why he's still alive with new bodies. Damn it, Orochimaru. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually one of my favorite Sigma fights of the SNES days. We meet again, X. My shield is way too awesome for you. Not even no, your it's... not even your bust of power. <laughs> sparkle, sparkle, sparkle! I hope you get a seizure before I finish this sentence. No, but this Sigma fight is actually pretty awesome. Just like, listen to the music. That's some pretty badass boss music. And I could have used, you Captain know. America. <laughs> Shield Slash! Oh, and apparently I killed him while he's standing up in the air. That was anticlimactic. I think I slashed him with my saber. Oh. Who 
turned off the lights. Blink! Wow. Well done, X. I am way weaker than you thought. <laughs> Behold the power of my... robot fat. Wow. <laughs> and once again, Sigma's tiny head is the weakness. Sigma, you've got yourself one hell of a badass magic suit there. Ultimate battle body. Rocket punch, rocket punch, hyper sigma force. <laughs> <laughs> He's even got another face in his chest. It's <laughs> like Grin Lagan about ten years previous. Oh wow, once again, I never thought of a Grin Lagan connection. <laughs> Gotta love it though. <sighs> yeah, like the only way to hit him is like through those vents in his shoulders. Or essentially aim for his head, but you know, if you're too low it won't work, and if you're too high it'll miss. Knock him out of the box, Luke. <laughs> and yes, that hurts a lot. <laughs> oh god! Thank you for demonstrating. <laughs> Damn it! Well, anyway, um, the problem with using the saber in the air is you basically stop everything and you just slash. You can't cling to the wall. And I think I'm refilling my sub tanks here, but don't worry, I don't think I do it for long. Yep. Okay. Don't worry, I'm better at editing He's than just that. Just standing there burning over his like, damn. <sighs> I got the laser crack in the face. Considering, the part, considering my face is the only part of me that's not a robot, that's pretty bad. Well, technically he is. Like, he is a robot robot everywhere. It's just his face looks human. Shut up, facts. I didn't <laughs> ask for your approval. <laughs> Logic man, shut up. <laughs> we meet again, again, X. I am Captain America. Again. I could have edited this fight again, but I don't know. I just kind of ended it so anticlimactically the first time. I didn't see any harm in doing it again. Does this one last longer? Possibly. <laughs> I'm not I'm not telling. I didn't forget. Swoosh! Shield slash. He's a, yeah, he's actually pretty tough. Bro, are you gonna die again? No. <laughs> yeah, without the saber, it's a little bit difficult. He's hard, he's hard. We get it, Tony. It, he's difficult. Just, just stop. <laughs> well done. Again, X. But I'm far weaker than my previous forms. Again. This temporary body is only temporary. Ah, I brought it back. Remember that joke? Remember? Hmm? I remember. I remember. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> I like how he only faces in one direction. <laughs> you, you can't be bothered, you know? He's way too important. Go all behind me, missiles. I think he... doesn't he look... no, he doesn't look the other way. Huh. Where did Megamon go? My missiles will find him for me. Ah, oh, there you are! Laser! Missiles harm in and destroy! <laughs> Transform and roll out. <laughs> kind of looks like he's firing water at you. It makes a kind of wishy noise as well. Yeah. What a gun! Oh, damn it. I guess we'll do it next time. <laughs> <laughs>